Medellin, Colombia. The barrio of Santo Domingo clings to the steep mountain slopes above the city. For decades, gangs of drug traffickers ruled these streets, which became some of the most dangerous in the world. Crime and geography conspired to sever the residents from the city below. But in 2004, city planners decided it was time to unite Medellin. 15 years ago, you can't be outside. You can't be after 5 p.m., 6 p.m. This was a very, very complex place. From the city below, the barrio of Santo Domingo was seen as dangerous and distant. But Echeverri could only see its potential, a vibrant community, sparkling with culture and life. Echeverri and his colleagues had a vision for a new city. They decided to turn Santo Domingo into a cultural mecca and entice commerce and the rest of Medellin to come to these neighborhoods. The project began by building public parks, playgrounds, and even internationally recognized state-of-the-art libraries. But getting people to visit from the valley below was literally an uphill battle. Medellin streets are narrow and steep, difficult and time-consuming for buses to navigate. The hill and the valley felt like two separate worlds. Y lo que se buscaba era generar conectividad entre los diferentes barrios, incluso también como una estrategia como de intercambio, llamémoslo de población, que históricamente ha tenido límites muy muy marcados. Echeverri and his fellow designers look to the sky for an answer. Enter Metro Cable. The transport system is one of the most powerful things to change things, to connect the society, to put in contact the different places of the, of the city. The cable car system united the city. Metro Cable's line to Santo Domingo carries some 18,000 passengers a day. Climbing more than a mile in less than 15 minutes to what was once considered the most dangerous barrio in Medellin. Santo Domingo is now bustling. Lina Maria Toro and family migrated to Santo Domingo several years ago. She has witnessed the transformation. No, salió uno de la casa, pues normal al parquecito de la cuadra y ya. Cambio ya por esto, ya la gente sube más, entonces ya hay más turismo. O sea, los negocios comerciales empiezan que a vender una cosa, que a vender otro. Yo creo que le está yendo mejor en ese sentido. O sea, eh, de una manera espectacular nos cambió la vida toda porque unió eh, barrios que creímos que no, no uniría a eso. Y el Metro Carrera los unió. Medellín's architects and planners have given their neighbors a new perspective on their city 